Yo, welcome to another video, boys. So, hope you guys are in good spirits. So, another loss for the week. What day is today? Tuesday, two. So, two uh, L's uh, for the week as we start, as we entered into third week. And uh, yeah, let's get into this. So, this trade I took. Um, you know based on the break of structure to the downside we ended up taking i mean i ended up taking around 64 points and then i like stopped it after that market did went down after the market open a half past two around 174 points but we don't care now that did the same thing on the other points let's come to the place that i've shared in the discord so you guys might be wondering like uh, why would i be entering in the like you know right after that so the only reason we took the loss on this trade is because i entered before 12 o'clock so it was right here we had a what it's called we had a spread hour and i thought spread hour has just like you know market structure but however it was the last day close as well so when the market opened and uh we had into like jpy like you know session the market like you know had a brick why i'm wumbling Woo! so um the market had a break of structure to the downside after that you can see the market just ripped and uh went to the downside pretty straightforward no rocket science we're just gonna read the chart so uh if we would have taken sell so we could have captured today how much we could have captured around 81 points on this beautiful gu uh for the day and on gj i took gj personally as well so took buys on that as well since it's more volatile so if there was um a sell on this one as well we could have made how many pips 166 pips on that i don't i didn't trade eu gu today however if i would have taken eu today we could have like you know be on breaking but nonetheless we don't talk any ifs and buts only absolutes so coming to the btc trade btc is still ranging and like you know after having a break of structure with the false news manipulation we can clearly see it just ran all the way up here which is around 29 900 in the spot and around 30k in the futures if you check the markets they're yeah, pretty straightforward boys uh we had a let's have a look uh, i got a text message from a client let's have a look so how much we lost today so we took an L of um one second. We took around eight hundred seventy one dollar ninety three pounds on one. As you can see, I made some profit on US shorts. I didn't share that. It was in my personal journal. On the other account, we lost around hundred. Uh, sorry, nine hundred and twenty eight dollars seventy seven cents. So altogether, we are down for eight down eighteen hundred dollars for the day. Me personally, and then also I was holding this long. Okay, and uh, didn't see enough volume for the day, so I had to like you know cut my losses so for the profit let's have a look what profit we had 50 percent on gmc not gmc gmt 230 percent on ape long 362 actually this was 500 percent but i only could able to get the 362 only let me show you the tomo chart right let's have a look here look at this beautiful chart right so we did have like a really good spike but i forgot to like you know take the profit out of it so by the time i took it you guys can see 362 percent then um yeah that's it for the day boys and uh i'll see you guys tomorrow in another video and if you guys haven't joined the community make sure you head to mts trade on x follow me over here and then click the link on the in the description bio and then uh, you'll be able to like you know head to my whoop shop and there you can join the community by ten dollars so if you want to know how i take plays and want to make profit it's a 20 like you know dollar a long one hour video youtube video you can just ape in and uh, back test and then you'll be sniping like i am and also want to show you something really golden right i took an auction long today all right can you see the entries what what is the entry 5.72 look at this well what the fuck was this man we had a 12% pump instantly as soon as I came out. Ah, these are the days, boys. These are the days. Well, you, I believed in myself. I said, all right, I don't feel confident in the play. I just like, you know, exit that break even. Didn't even bother. And then 
few months later it just ripped so yeah it ended up hitting like you know tp1 if we held it how much we would have made around six percent yeah it's uh still like you know gg so guys that's a wrap i'll see you in tomorrow's video and blaze will take so stay safe stay hard and i'll see you in another trading video cheers